If you happen to have links to external web pages that reside within content itself, it's real important to make sure that, that those links open up in their own window. The reason for this is something called mixed content. The, what mixed content means is that you have a secure website, which is what we're in in D2L, HTTPS, and when you're linking out to other websites, it has HTTP, so it's considered non-secure. And browsers like Chrome and Firefox specifically are going to block that unless you have it open in its own window. And so that's what I want to show you how to do. So hopefully you can figure out which of your content has that. But if you don't, you have to just go through each of the content in your, in your files to see. So this shows you content. So I'm going to go ahead and click on this. And you'll see I have a web link in here. And if I click on that web link, again, it appears like nothing happens. But if you look up here, you'll see a shield. And again, I'm using uh, Chrome. If I'm using Firefox, the shield will be over here. If I'm using an Internet Explorer, there would be something to say show all content. But to avoid any of that, we really want this to open up in its own tab. So to do that, what I'm going to do is to edit this, this HTML. So I'm going to click on the little options menu here and click on Edit HTML. What I'm going to do is highlight this link here and I'm going to click on I'm going to click on this little icon right here and that is going to link, take me to the what's called a quick link and since this is already linked it will bring up this information and all I need to do is change this to new window and click update then I click update on that HTML page it's going to be saved successfully and now if I click on this it should open up in its own tab as you can see and I can go right back into the course and the students can close that and there should be no issues with what's called mixed content.